Tego. Welcome back to the series and to episode six. Today we're, wait, where the hell is Don? Remember Barry, I told you he went home with that bimbo from the club last night. Oh, you're kidding. Nope. I remember him talking to her, but that was around the time you passed out from all the molly and ecstasy we took. My bad, Barry, my blood pressure is not what it used to be. It's all good, buddy. Can I let you in on a little secret, though? And what's that? Yeah, I paid that chick to act like she didn't know who Donald Trump was. Oh, <laughs> his ego couldn't have handled that. <laughs> yeah, that's oh, why I that's did it. that's why he went home with it. I bet it drove him nuts. Well, while we wait on his dumb ass, let me show you a trick on this slide. See how I turned around hitting that wall? Now I hit this one and jump. Oh, wow. I can skip the entire slide. What the hell, Barry? That's sick as fuck. So this is the princess's secret slide? That's right, Joe. There's two stars on it, one for completing the slide and one for finishing it in under 20 seconds. Oh, okay, I'll go ahead and get the other star then. Perfect. Then we can visit a new map afterwards. Oh, I can't wait. Hey, Barry, you want to hear a joke? Sure, Joe, what you got for me? Did you hear what happened to the piece of chocolate cake? Uh, I don't know. What happened to the piece of chocolate cake? I destroyed it just like I destroyed your mom last night. Joe, are you just insulting me because Don isn't here for you to rip on? Uh, yeah, kind of. If you use all your good material on me, you won't have any left for Donald. Ah, uh, shit, you've got a point there. And anyhow, why don't you focus on this star before you fuck it up and ask me to take over again? Oh, ouch. Oh, double ouch. See what I mean? Yeah, well, I still made it. Look at me go. That's another star for us, Joe. One step closer to 120. That's right, baby. This game is too damn easy. We'll be finished in no time. Hell yeah, Barry. So where are we headed now? We're gonna visit Big Boo's Haunt, the spookiest map there is. Oh, I don't like that, I'm easily spooked. Me too, Joe, but we'll just have to push through. Oh, Jesus, this is terrifying, Mary. Don't worry, Joe, it, it's, uh, it's gonna be all right, buddy. Oh God, Barry, if, if you're scared, I, I, I'm flocky, terrified. Ah, fuck! God damn it, I forgot about that shit. A little warning would have been nice. I'm sorry, Joe. Boo. Ah! Jesus fucking Christ, Donald. Don't fucking do that. You scared the ever-loving fuck out of me. Yeah, well, that's what you dipshits get for trying to pull a fast one on me with that bimbo. Oh, you figured that out? Yeah, I figured that out. There's no such thing as someone who doesn't know Donald Trump. I just let you guys think I went home with her. Plus, I have no need for bimbos. I have a lovely wife at home. A lovely wife that you let me smash all the time? Eh, shut the fuck up, Joe. Now give me that controller. It's bound to be my turn. It is. Joe and I already got one star each on the secret slide. All right, perfect. I'll take over clapping these ghost cheeks the way I clapped Jill's last night. Oh, Donnie, the only clapping sound you heard was your own stomach fat rolls flopping around. Yeah, these fat rolls probably make you hungry, you pale zombie freak. Probably just waiting for us to fall asleep before he eats our brains, Barry. Don, where are you going? We already did this room. I'm grabbing the vanish cap again so that I'm invulnerable to Zombie Joe's assault. You are a complete moron. Besides, I'm all muscle anyway, so if he tried something, I could take him. Don, you look like the world's largest Monsanto citrus fruit ate its way out of a hostess truck and then beat that fat kid in Matilda in a chocolate cake eating contest. Shut the fuck up, Joe. Now hurry up and beat these ghosts. I'm feeling a little more brave now that I have an orange Shrek here to defend me. Stupid fucking ghosts. Don, what do you have against ghosts? They aren't even real. Of course they're real. I see them all the time at Trump Tower, haunting the place fucking pathetic creatures, like Joe here. Maybe they're the ghosts of your overworked, underpaid employees who starve to death. I wish you'd starve to death, sleepyhead. All right, knock it off, guys. Don't make me regret allowing you two to insult each other on stream. Aw, uh, Barry, why don't you try it sometime? It's fun. Yeah, Barack, give us your best insult. Oh, yeah, geez, come I don't on, know, you guys. I kind of just want to focus on the game. Come on, one insult, Barry. That's all we ask. Yeah, roast me or Don. He's easy to roast. Eat my ass, you sack of bones. All right, all right, fine. Uh, I'll do one. Yeah, all right, hell yeah, let's hear it. Don, you're a Mountain Dew uh, maniac, and Joe, you're a, a, a cotton-headed ninny muggins. I take it back. Oh, shit, Barry, that was Barry, pretty don't lame. Ever do and I mean, like, that wasn't like even good again. enough to sit at the loser table. That was just complete and total failure. That was more of a miss than that Metallica Lou Reed collaboration. Gee, thanks, guys. That really makes me want to try that ever again. Well, don't be a pussy about it. Just man up and come up with some better insults next time. Yeah, we're done with this conversation. Anyway, I'm getting the booze balcony star. I could never find this one as a kid because I didn't know about this hidden door up here. Yep, this spot is easy to miss. I don't blame you on that. Whoa, it's almost like a hidden room in the mansion. Kind of. There actually is a hidden room, but that's for later. This whole map is literally just ghost boss fights. They use the same boss three times. 
Yep, makes you wonder if they ran out of space to add more content or just ran out of ideas. Hey, why not both? Jesus, Barry, how can you even tell what you're doing with this weird fixed camera angle they used here? Trick of and don't say trick of the trade. <laughs> well, speaking of that, I do have an announcement for you guys. Let's pause for a moment. Wait a minute, you're not saying... You mean it's here? That's right, boys. Merchandise has arrived. Choose from an exciting array of products from the channel store, each bearing the classic tagline, Trick of the Trade. Now you can be in on the joke every time I play circles around the boys in this game. Everyday products you love, from phone cases and hats to sweatshirts or mugs. The store is easy to find. Simply navigate to our channel page, click the store tab on the menu, then click any item. Choose your favorite product and cycle through the different color options to find your favorite look. Grab a comfy signature hoodie in my favorite color configuration. Because you're a legend, so get out there and stun them. Thank you for all of your love and support. Now back to the video. Wow, holy Good crap, shit, Barry, Barry, that was I'm insane. I'm definitely getting me one of those hats. Aw, oh, thanks guys, I was up all night with Michelle putting that together. Much cooler than the mega hats Don likes to wear. Your parents should have aborted you, Joe. Didn't ask. So which star do I do on this stage? Take a left here and check out the shed there. Oh, all right. Damn. This looks creepy as fuck. Running around in circles makes some bad guys roll their eyes. Holy shit, Joe. You learned how to read? Yep. Now we're just waiting for you to learn how to lose weight. Feel the weight of my total wrath as I shit fury all over your life. God, you watch too much TV. What does that even mean, shit fury? Just sounds like you ate Taco Bell earlier or something. I would never cross the border for that disgusting foreign food, Joe. I only eat real American cuisine. Taco Bell is an American chain, Doc. And the only food I need for proper sustenance is McDonald's, home of the Big Mac, large fry, and the world's best Coca-Cola. I can hear you getting fatter. And I can hear your hearse arriving. Now focus so that it'll be my turn sooner. What the hell is this place? The ghosts merry-go-round. You gotta fight all the small ghosts and then the large one will appear again. Fun fact, they actually call merry-go-rounds a galloper in Britain. Who the fuck asked? Donald, sometimes it's fun to learn new things. The only thing you need to know about Britain is that the people call everything by the wrong names, and they all smell like tea and biscuits. Donald, would you please stop generalizing entire groups of people? Barry, for future reference, here's an example of a good roast. Did you know that Don is actually a COVID test? Huh, what the fuck do I have to do with that fake virus test? The test is, if you can't smell Don's B.O., you definitely have COVID. Shut the fuck up, Joe. Joe, I don't know how you come up with shit like that on the fly. Eh, call it a gift. The greatest gift you could give this world is leaving it. I'm gonna have to leave it if you get any fatter. Joe, I will gut you like a fish. Any excuse to talk about food, huh? Okay, guys, shut the fuck up. Fish are friends, not food, Joe. Anyway, Don, you're up. Excellent. Shouldn't take me long as usual. So which star is this? Secret of the Haunted Books. It features a nifty little puzzle mechanic more reminiscent of Legend of Zelda or Banjo-Kazooie. Oh, I hope that doesn't involve reading, otherwise Don's shit out of luck. Good one, numb nuts. Joe, come on. I'm picturing a room where the books fly off the shelves and beat the shit out of Don. Cap! That is strangely accurate, Joe. <laughs> Holy shit. Look at this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck the off. The books are beating the shit out of Don. He can't fucking uh, read. Shut the fuck up, Look you fucking Oh, awesome. my God. I can't. Don's a fucking idiot, dude. <laughs> You're older than Joe, all of these fuck. ancient books, you Stop it. skeleton. <laughs> <laughs> get fucked, buddy. <laughs> and I still fucking made it, so get fucked, guys. Way to go, Don. Nice start, All right, star nicely grab. played, Don. All right. Living proof that even a Neanderthal can fiddle fuck his way through life. Eat my ass, Joe. All right, one more star, and then let's take a break. I'm getting hungry. Sounds good. Where are we thinking tonight? Not McDonald's, if that's what you're asking. I think I like some Chick-fil-A, actually. You can't. It's Sunday. God damn it, I always do that. I only think of Chick-fil-A on fucking Sunday. It's a life goal of mine to become the CEO of Chick-fil-A and open their asses up seven days a week. Life goal, huh? Better fucking hurry then. Oh, suckle on my ding-dong bitch. I will say, though, that that is the best idea I've ever heard out of you, ever. I appreciate it, pal. Anyway, Barry, what's this star you're doing? Eye to eye in the secret. Oh, fuck, I forgot I need the vanish cap. Even the great Barry fucks up sometimes. True enough, but I'll be back up there in no time. And I've got a neat glitch to show you guys while we're at it. Sweet, love to see some tricks. So normally with Mr. Eye, the eyeball enemy in this game, you have to run around him in circles to spin him out. The regular version of him gets you a blue coin, but the boss version of him in the secret room gets you a star. Oh, okay, I see. Now the neat trick with this enemy is that if you take damage and then enter his hitbox and crouch down, 
Your invincibility frames go on infinitely until you exit his hitbox again. Check it out. Oh, what wow. the hell? Now I just crawl in a circle and it still works the same way. He'll spin out as intended and I'll get the star. That's nuts, dude. What the hell? Jesus Christ, I had no idea you could do some shit like that. How is that even possible? Trick of the trade, Don. My God. Yeah, you're so tricky, Barry. The only thing that's tricky is you weighing yourself without breaking the scale. Oh, Jesus my Christ. my God. Barry strikes back. That was a great That was roast, actually a Barry. good comeback. I got to hand it to me. you, Barack. Oh, thanks, guys. I guess hanging out with you two is giving me some ideas. Anyway, let's go grab some pizza and then start working on the next episode. Sounds like a plan. Count me in, fellas. Welcome back to the series and to episode seven. We're gonna grab a few stars we missed before heading out to the next new map. And if I recall correctly, I believe it's my turn. And I believe you only got that right due to the 33% chance you had, because we can't rely on you to recall anything correctly. Shut the hell up, Donald. Go complain about Macy's not carrying equator waist size jeans or something. Implying that royalty like me would ever shop at a peasant store like that. My dog dresses better than people who shop at Macy's. Jeez, your dog's still alive. Surprised you haven't eaten him yet. Shut the fuck up, Joe. All right, knock it off, you two. Joe, here's the controller. Go ahead and grab the eight red coins of the secret aquarium. Ooh, it's that pretty music again. Ah, uh, I see why you picked Joe to do this one. Now we get to listen to this goaded song for like 10 years. Don, you're literally the only reason I'm not worried about global warming raising the sea levels. With all the extra land mass you provide, it'll be like having a whole extra continent to inhabit. Now, the reason you're not worried about global warming, besides it being fake alarmist bullshit, is because you wouldn't be alive long enough to see it happen anyway. We're only one minute into the video, and I'm already going to have to put you two in time out. My bad, Barry. I can't help it when he instigates. All right, way to get the star, Joe. What do you mean, way to get the star? This star is freer than America. America before or after Russia colluded to win you the election. If Russia intervened in my favor, then why didn't they win me the 2020 election as well? Maybe most Americans got tired of having a land whale for a president. Hilarious, Joe. It actually is. All right, Don, which star are you going after? I want to finish off Womp's Fortress, so red coins plus 100 coin star together. So 100 coins also gets you a star? That's right, Joe. There are 15 main courses in this game, and each of them grants you a 100 coin star. Side courses do not, even if you manage to collect 100 coins in one of them. So main courses actually have seven stars, not six? Exactly. Also, Don, do you not know the route for these coins? Nah, just let me do it my own way, Barry. Uh, all right then. Jesus Christ, took you long enough. Joe, that was pristine. I sense jealousy. No one has ever gotten Womp's 100s faster than that. Believe me. Saying believe me doesn't make people more likely to just believe you, Don. It does if you consider his voter base. Hillbillies and a bunch of blue-collar retards. Joe, we can't say the R word. My bad, Barry. Both of you shut up and watch this. Holy shit, Jesus Don. Jesus Christ. Don, that was an amazing jump. Of course it was. It was my jump, after all. Please don't jump in real life or you'll shake the ground again. Shut the fuck up, Joe. OK, I think it's time to head to the new map. So where are we headed now, Barry? We're going to visit Shifting Sandland, the quintessential desert stage in the game. And since it's my turn, let me start it off with one of my favorite stars to do. All right, let's see it. Check it out. Jesus Holy Christ, Barry, shit, Obama. wow. I didn't know you could get the bird star like that. How the fuck did you do that? Trick of the trade, Don. Oh, I wish you'd never say that again. And I wish you'd go on a diet, but we all want things, huh? And I wish you'd book the correct fucking flight, sleepyhead. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, Don. All right, hey, the flight ended up not being too bad with Joe's montage he put together for us. That's right, bitch. And anyway, Joe, you're up. Let's see how you fare on the new map. All right, so what am I supposed to do? Get a good view of the top of the pyramid real quick. J Joe, you can't stand on that, Joe. It's not like a box object. It's different. Oh, all right then. See it up there? Uh, I think I see it. Should be a piece of cake. 
Joe, not that way. It's a dead end. You got to go all the way around from the right side. You're being awfully helpful today. What's your deal? Did they pardon you in court today or something? No, you dildo. I just want my turn again. Fucking knew you were going to say some dumb shit like that. I say what I want. You trying to cut across, Joe? Yeah, I mean, this seems like a reasonable way to approach this star, right? No. No, it doesn't, Joe. It sure doesn't. Well, who the fuck asked you? It's possible to do it that way, but it's a little more advanced. You might just try going all the way around the intended way. I guess so, yeah. I'll try it how Miyamoto intended. God, I wish it was anyone's turn right now instead of yours. Literally anyone would be faster. Not faster than I blew my load inside Melania last night. Joe, can you stop talking about how you ravaged Don's wife in every fucking video? Look, the man asked for it. If he's going to be a dick, I'm going to tell him true stories about his wife. Here's a true story for you. Donald, please. Guess what I did for Mother's Day? Oh, uh, don't care. I dug up your mom and destroyed her. Jesus uh -huh. Christ. Uh, Donald, that is actually crossing the line. Donald, miss me with that cap. You literally have negative riz. I have riz. I'm the rizziest person to ever riz. When I am on television, all of the ladies swoon and then they divorce their husbands in the hope that they might someday have a shot with me. I've literally never heard anything more absurd. Okay, Barry, help. This shit is making me nervous. Joe, quick, long jump across the gap there. Hey, nicely done. Oh, what I wouldn't give to have your gamer brain for a minute. There he goes again, zombie freak wanting brains. Don't worry, Don, I wouldn't eat your brain. It's too high and saturated fat. Joe, you can't even get through a speech without slurring like a drunken sailor. Your brain shows up blank on scans. Yeah, your mom. All right, that's enough. Focus on the game. My bad, Barry. And nice job making it across, Joe. Hey, look, one of those cannon opener guys. Watch out for that bird. The what now? Dude doesn't even know what a bird is. It's too late, Joe. He's going to take your hat. My what now? Jesus, Joe, is there anybody home? Yeah, I just need you guys to speak up is all. What the? Dude, where'd my hat go, man? Jesus Christ. The bird took it, Joe. That flying cocksucker took it? Yep, we just got done explaining this to you. Where is he? Where do you think a bird would be, Joe? Look up in the sky. There it is. What the? Give it back, bitch. Joe, calm down. This is fucking bullshit. He has my fucking hat. Well, go up the pillar and just jump into him. You'll get it back. Where do you think he's going to go with your hat, Joe? Probably up your mom's fucking ass. Hey, come on. I'm pissed, dude. I want my hat back. There you go. You got it. Hell yeah. Now put that MAGA hat back on. Don, that's not a MAGA hat. Sure it is. Look, it's red. And what do you think the M stands for anyway? You're literally a moron. Dude, these courses just get harder and harder. Well, that's what's fun about a game, though, right? You learn certain basic skills, and then they get put to the test in progressively harder stages. Uh, I guess so. Uh, oh, fuck, I'm on fire. Help! Joe, just slow down. It will go out no, on its own. Oh, wait. God, fuck. Damn it, shit. <laughs> Joe, you've got to stay calm in those situations. I know. I just, it's all too much for me today. It's fine. Just give it another shot. Yes, please do. It's very entertaining. Eat a dick, Don. This time, avoid the fire and just jump to the next layer instead of trying to walk up them. boy, Joe. Man, I've never seen such riveting gameplay. You won't see any gameplay in prison except anal play, so enjoy this while it lasts. Careful, Joe. Oh, shit, no, please. Is there any universe where you don't fuck this up? Maybe not, because there sure ain't any universe where you're not fat. Keep going, almost there, just around the bend. Oh, this is so stressful, dude. Wow. Joe, I told you to jump up those slopes. I don't even care anymore, Barry. You just do this one. For once, I agree. Get this star the fuck over with already. All right, boys, here goes. Now watch closely. I don't want to have to repeat myself. What the? Seriously? Are you fucking kidding me? Why would I ever go all the way around when I could just do that? Joe, you couldn't do that in a million years. Don't kid yourself. This game is so fucking broken, dude. It sure is, but that's part of what I love about it so much. Anyway, Donald, you're up to bat, so here's the controller. Hell yes, it's my time to shine once again. Now watch as the Don slays the eight red coins of the desert. Ooh, that's a bold move, Don. This is one of the toughest eight red coin stars of the game. So what makes it so hard? Definitely not Jill. Shut the fuck up, Don. Well, the eight red coins on this map are very spread out. The map is dangerous enough to traverse as it is with all the insta-death quicksand, and four of the red coins are in the air, which can be very difficult if you're not comfortable with the flying controls of the game. Plus, if your wing cap runs out at an inopportune time, it could also mean death. Donald, what the hell are you doing? Boosting my speed. Well, you're actually losing it every time you go up that slope. Didn't ask. I know what I'm doing. Uh-huh. Dude thinks he's a genius. Oh, I know, but it's fine. Let him play. I'll tell you, I've been playing Black Ops Zombies lately on my favorite map, Ascension. So my reaction time has been at an all-time high, speedier than Hunter Biden's brain on cocaine. I fucking love Black Ops Zombies, dude. Yep. 
When I play, I pretend all the zombies are you, Joe, and I take great pleasure in shooting every single one of them square in the head. You guys are just the nicest friends anybody could have. You got that right. All right, so now you're getting the aerial red coins? Yep, just got to blast off and fly for them. Ah, uh, fuck, hold on. Joe, what's wrong? <laughs> uh, my allergies have been bothering me lately. <laughs> Hippopotamus. 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 Saying hippopotamus over and over prevents sneezing. That's literally the dumbest thing I've ever heard. Guys, I swear it's a trick that I. Uh, you. God damn it. Worked real well from what I can tell. Yeah, well, it usually does, so. I seriously doubt that. All right, guys, pass or smash. Nancy Pelosi. Come you, on, dude. Don. Not She's like an age leather bag. Hillary Clinton. Oh, God. I wouldn't hit that with a truck. How about Lindsey Graham? Don, that's a man. Oh, yeah, I always forget with his girly ass name. Uh, how about Alexandria Ocasio Cortez? Smash. Yeah, I agree. Cringe liberal, but I would absolutely smash. Don't tell Melania. How about Sarah Palin? Oh, boy, what a lady. Oh, Joe, you've always wanted to smash her. She's probably the most useless politician to ever exist. Nah, she's all right. She endorsed me, after all. My point exact. All right, nice, nice star job, grab, Nice job, buddy. Don. That's Way one more star for us. Thank you, thank you. You're up, Barry. What you got for us? All right, guys, last star of the video. And try not to shit your pants. This one is a monster. Oh, shit, I'm excited. Let's see it. What the fuck? Dude, what? How are you? Barry, what? Dude, what? No way. Dude. You just skipped the entire inside of the pyramid. I have never seen anything like that. Told you guys this one would be wicked. How the hell could you even learn to do all of that? Trick of the trade, Don. Fucking Christ. All right, guys, let's take a break and do some Black Ops zombies, and we'll get back to this in a few hours. Hell yeah, and I'm going to roll a ray gun on my first box. Count on it. And I'm going to buy Quick Revive, because I know Joe is going to go down every five fucking seconds. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, Don. <sighs> oh, fuck, here they all come. How do I get this gun on? Hell yeah. America number one, motherfuckers. Second Amendment, bitch. Yeah. Fuck. Oh, God. Get the fuck out of here. Uh, Need some money for that. Seriously? There's an awful lot of Joes on this fucking map. Jesus Christ. Uh, get daddy some meal kick. Oh, fuck, yeah, insta-kill. Bye, Joe. Goodbye, Joe. Bye, Joe. Bye, Joe. See you later, Joe. Goodbye, Joe. Joe Biden. Fuck you. Fuck you, Joe Biden. Fuck you, Joe Biden. Fuck you, Joe Biden. Hey, Don, what's up, buddy? Uh, God damn it, Joe, you messed me up. Skill issue. I was literally doing so well. Don, you were supposed to be getting some rest. We played this game for literally 12 hours last night. Have you been up all night trying to beat my score? Just shut up and play the intro. <laughs> well, welcome back to the series and to episode eight. All right, before we begin, we're running a 15% off sale on all merch in the store at the moment. Use code 15 off at checkout. Check the description for details and a direct link. The sale ends at the end of May, so don't wait. The merch is litty. Don't sleep on it like Sleepy Joe would. My hat is so fucking cool. Everywhere I go, all the girls are staring at it. They're staring because they are shocked that you're still alive. Projecting. All right, Joe, you need to stand on all four pillars to make something cool happen. Ooh, something cool. Will it make Don lose 800 pounds? Why would I lose pounds? I only deal in US dollars. I was talking about your weight, dumbass. Everything with you is about money. Shut up, Joe. Uh, daddy, can I have a small loan of a million dollars? Uh, daddy, can I have a small loan of your cock in my ass? You're literally one good punch away from death. All right, last pillar. At long last, after an hour of waiting. Holy shit, I'm blowing the top off. Just like I blew the top off of Jill last night when I huffed and I puffed. Didn't take much, though. There wasn't anything to hold her top up because her saggy ass titties go down to her knees. Shut the fuck up, Don. I am the big bad Don. Joe, just grab the box there. The angle is perfect. Just trust me. Oh, 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 fuck. Oh. Oh! See? All good. So is this the same entrance you used the bomb to clip into last video? That's right, Joe. Since the top of the pyramid is actually just a game object sitting on a floor polygon, 
It allows Mario to exploit the game's physics in such a way. But how do you explain all of that crazy trickery with the bomb? Do you really need to ask? Barry is the world's foremost bomb expert. He's drone striked Yemen and every other country in the world countless times. Shut the fuck up, Donald. You've dropped more drone strikes than pounds in the past 10 years. Anything to keep America safe from dangerous foreigners. You mean anything to maintain our oil interests? I love America and I love money. We, we know, know Donald. Donald. Okay, what is this place? Joe. Joe, why would you long jump right there? What is going through that partially decomposed brain of yours? I couldn't see what to do. The camera was being weird. What's in your head? In your head? Zombie, zombie. Oh, can zombie. it, you fat dipshit. E, e. What's in your head? Donald, that in is your terrible. Head. We are definitely zombie. losing subscribers for this. Zom Not as many as we're losing for Sleepy Joe's sleepy fucking gameplay. Eat a dick, Don. Oh shit, what the fuck? All right, Joe, get ready. Dude, I don't like this. Things are about to get out of hand, Joe. You're about to get clapped. I just wanted to point that out. Donald, enough. Oh no, oh God. Fight him, Joe, punch the eyes. Help! Ah! What are you doing, you colossal pussy? I'm hiding, fuck this. Get out there, Joe. Hands shouldn't have eyes, dude. Hey, you know what that looks like, Joe? Yeah, I read you loud and clear, Barry. That pounding fist looks like Don throwing a tantrum when the line at McDonald's is backed up. Fuck off, you guys. <laughs> Nice job, buddy. Way well to go, played. Joe. You did it. Dur me angry. McDonald's closed. No <laughs> food. Fuck you. You walk me up hungry. <laughs> Joe, fuck. All right, nice star grab, Joe. Thanks, Larry. All right, Don, you're up. Which one are you going for? Uh, I'll grab the hundred coins and secrets together just to finish this map. You up. mean we have to sit through another one of Ronald's 100 coin routes? I might be dead by the time he accomplishes that. First of all, my name is Donald with a D, you dementia-riddled fuck. Second, I'm pretty sure you called him Larry earlier, so you might be right about dying soon. Your brain's mushier than Jill's left ass cheek. Shut the hell up, Donald. Everything I say and do is irony and satire. Ain't that the truth. Don, can I please show you a route for these coins? No, dude, just let me do it my own way. I, uh, as you wish. that damn music off. Haha, <laughs> fine, but hurry up, dude. You don't rush perfection. Don, you can't even get the 100 coin star. You entered the pyramid with only 38 coins, and while the inside of the pyramid has exactly 62 coins, you killed a Goomba earlier and let its coin despawn, so you're fucked. Why can't he just exit the pyramid and get more coins outside? They didn't add a warp to go back outside. Going inside the pyramid is a one-way door. Are you serious, man? I went through all of this work for nothing. I'm serious, man. What the? I'm not supposed to be here. I shouldn't be here. Hey, settle down there, leaky faucet. All right, you know what? Go ahead. Have a look. Take a laugh. Don't just get the five secret stars so that this wasn't a complete waste of time. Eh, uh, whatever. Way to go, moron. Shut the fuck up, Joe. And I'll grab the hundred coins so we can speed this shit up. Fuck yeah, does that mean new map after this? New map it is. Good, I'm tired of all the sand. Not as tired as we are of watching you suck at getting 100 coin stars. Fight me, Joe. All right, we are officially going upstairs, boys. Oh, hell yeah, wonder what'll be up. Hey, wait, when did we get the key for this door? Uh, you'll have to ask Jordan Peterson about that. Oh, did he get it? No, just never mind, Joe. All righty then. What the hell, how did you just clip through the staircase? Trick of the trade, Don. Wow, new area in the castle. This is so exciting. Yes, sir. And we're going to make a quick stop to another star-bearing toad here. All right, guys, pass or smash. Tommy Laren. I, I don't mean to be pedantic, Don, but it's smash or pass. Who the hell cares? You knew what I meant, you fucking nerd. Now answer. Uh, she's obviously conventionally attractive, but she's too much of a cringe reactionary. Maybe I'd hit it from behind. I don't know. Jesus. 
How about Abigail Shapiro? Oh my God, those milkers. Obama, I know you have wet dreams about Abigail. Don't fucking deny it. <sighs> I would drink her milk unpasteurized. Is that what you wanted to hear? Hell yeah, Barry. I can't wait to tell Ben that. Don, you tell Ben what you would do to his sister every time you see him. I know, that's why we're such good friends. All right, now pay attention. This is Tiny Huge Island, Joe, and I'm gonna get all five secrets for my first star. Wow, this map is small. Ah, but you'll soon see the cool gimmick with this map. What in the fuck, Barry? You just teleported to the top of the mountain through the wall. How the hell did you do that? You really need to ask, trick of the trade, of course. My God. You're up, Joe. Hell yeah, let's do this. Hey, how about Candace Owens? Please, no more smash or pass, guys. I'm gonna pass. Wait, really, what don't you like about her? She's fine and all, good looking and good politics. She's just a, not my thing. You mean she's black? 100% it's because she's no, black. No, 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 it is not that. I just, uh, uh -huh, sure, rationalize more, buddy. Oh, fuck off, you guys. All right, Joe, get over to that pipe and you'll see what this map is all about. Oh boy, what could it even be? Maybe it's in the title, Tiny Huge Island? Yeah, Tiny and Huge, you're dicking your ass, respectively. Eat my ass, Joe. I oh, know, thank you. Hop in, I want you to see it. I'm a hoppin. What the? Wait. Oh, it's just an enlarged version of the tiny map. Tiny, huge, oh, I get it now. About time, too. OK, you need to defeat all of the giant piranha plants. Roger that, Barry. Hey, did I tell you guys there was a development with the Melania story? Oh, god, not that shitty fucking story again. Is it going to have an actual beginning, middle, and end this time? What's the update that she's boning some guy on the side, and that guy is me? Just shut up and listen, all right? So I told her I didn't mind that she was getting these expensive hair appointments, and it turns out the place she gets it done just happens to have a suspect name on bank statements. Right, okay. Anyway, she said she felt bad that she wasn't asking for permission and spending that much on her hair. Uh -huh. And I looked her dead in the eye and I tell you, I said, I've spent five grand on a bottle of whiskey without a care in the world. Pa please tell me that's not the end of the story. What do you mean? Yeah, that's the end. Good God, man, you really need to learn how to tell a story. Oh, fuck you, bro. Donald, I've read better stories written on the walls in gas station bathrooms. Shut the fuck up, I Joe. can't believe you actually thought there was any point to you opening your fat face and telling us any of that. That bitch really left? Wait, how is he still playing? He took the controller with him. He must be in the game room next door. Remember, we always have our broadcasts playing on that TV anyway. Oh, well, what should we do? Let's, uh, let's give him a few minutes to cool off. One hour later. Hey, welcome back. I love how he's still playing seamlessly while moving between rooms. You guys are douchebags, but it's OK. I figured out how you're going to make it up to me. Seems fair. We were a bit harsh. What you got for us? The next star you're going to do is the second race with Koopa the Quick. You two are going to do the race. If Barry wins, Joe has to go without ice cream for a week. Wait, what? If Joe wins, then Barry, you have to do a freestyle rap about this game at the end of the video. I like how you picked me to do the rap. No fucking complaints. You guys owe me. All right, fine, Joe. Let's do this. Wait, what? This should be entertaining. All right, good luck, Joe. Just know that I'm not going to hold back, Barry. Ice cream is on the line here. And they're off. Joe, you're going the wrong way. Are you sure about that? Here we have two top contenders in Mario gaming. Who will be victorious? It's going to be me. It's looking close, fellas. Joe's taking the backwards approach with the shell. Barry's going the standard route. Both are being buffeted by wind. What's it gonna be? Oh my goodness, Barry almost falls off. Who's gonna finish first? It's a photo finish. Hell yeah, bitches. What the fuck? Joe Jay wins it by two day, tenths of a second. I can't believe it, ladies and gentlemen. I've never seen anyone beat the race going the opposite direction before. Joe, how did you even know how to do that? Trick of the trade, Barry. You did not <laughs> just trick of the trade me, Joe. Oh, I think he did. And you, my friend, owe us a rap. Now let's hear it. You're right, you're right. Just give me a second to warm up. No warm ups, I'm playing the track. Here we go. Oh, Come Jesus. on, Barry, I know you can do it. Give us that fire wrap, dog. Yep, let's hear them bars, Barry. I want these lines to be cleaner than Joe's lines of coke. All right, you guys asked for it, so here it is. Uh. Yo, it's Mario, and spitting fire like I spin Bowser On a quest for stars through the 64 browser Kicking at Peach's castle, jumping off the walls Running through the levels, dodging traps and fireballs From Bob on Battlefield to Dire Dire Docks I'm stacking up my coins, yeah, I'm breaking all the blocks With a cap on my head, I'm invincible, I got it made Y'all ask me how I do it, that's a trick of the trade oh. 
That was insane. He's on fire. I think I'm in love. Gosh, guys, it wasn't that good, was it? Comment below if you like Barry's freestyle. Uh, <laughs> shut the fuck up, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> this is all a political ploy, believe me. Was it a political move when you stuck your dick in Stormy Daniels? You falsified business documents and paid hush money to a porn star. You're going in the pokey, dude. Don's going to prison. I am not going to prison. Melania needs me. You cheated on her, you moron. Don't worry, Don. I'll take good care of Melania while you're behind bars. And by good care, I mean I'll be having sexual intercourse with Shut her. Shut the fuck up, Joe. All right, all right. Let's just get back to the game. Hopefully we can finish it before Donald has to do time. Oh my God, I'm never gonna hear the end. Anyway, welcome back to the series and to episode nine. Today we're going to clean up a lot of the earlier stars we missed, including some 100 coin stars. I don't know how fun this will be to stream, but we'll make it work somehow. And you two raced each other last, so it's my turn now. I'm getting the wing cap red coins, since Sleepy Joe was too goddamn challenged to get them in episode three. Smoke my pole, Don, I did my best. It's fascinating how your best is always mediocre. It's fascinating how you're still breathing Breathing, given that heart disease is the number two cause of death. Wait, number two? I thought it was number one. What's number one then? Don falling down the stairs. Whoever he bowls over is killed instantly. He does this all the time. Shut the fuck up, Joe. If you fell down the stairs, it would break every fragile little bone in your pathetic body. Including the one inside Melania? I'm gonna kill this man, I swear to God. All right, chill out, guys. He says he's screwing my wife in every fucking video. Oh, I do not. You actually do, Joe, every single episode. Not every episode. Literally every single one. All right, Joe, it's your turn. Take this controller if your decrepit hands and eyes can still coordinate movement. They could coordinate twisting the fuck out of Melania's titties last night, so I wouldn't worry. Oh, we're talking about Melania now? Joe. Yeah, I gaped that leathery whore so hard last night, it was like throwing a hot dog down a hallway. Joe, shut the fuck up. I'm just gonna pound these pillars harder than I pounded Melania last night. Would you mind entering the map, sleepyhead? I'll enter the map just like I entered Melania raw last night with my wiggly willy. You can't get a single star on your own without Barry holding your hand. Through it. I can get this star just like I got my nut deep inside Melania. Plus, I have no need for bimbos. I have a lovely wife at home. A lovely wife that you let me smash all the time. Eh, shut the fuck up, Joe. Literally anyone would be faster. Not faster than I blew my load inside Melania last night. What's the update that she's boning some guy on the side and that guy is me? And then earlier you said you would take care of her by fucking her while I'm in prison. <laughs> well, I guess I do say it a lot, huh? But to be fair, that's the funniest part of the video. No, the fuck it is not, Joe. As soon as I'm back in the Oval Office, I am ordering a drone strike to your house, Joe. What, in 2028 when you're out of prison? Oh, oh fuck, Barry got him. Hilarious. Never heard that one before. Anyway, I'm grabbing the reds I skipped on the first Bowser stage. I haven't done this star in ages, so I'm probably going to be quite rusty. I'm sure it'll be sick like it always is. There you go, sucking him off already. You should watch that envy of yours. It's not a good look on you. And you should watch where you're walking. Maybe you wouldn't fall all the time. Try not to fall on any dicks in prison. Will you guys fuck off with the prison talk? I'm not going to prison. Unfortunately, you're probably right. The most you'll get is a slap on the wrist, a punitive fee that you'll probably pay off with donations, and maybe house arrest at the very most. It's nauseating what the elite rich can get away with. You say that like you two aren't part of the same crowd. Eat my entire fucking ass, both of you. Anyway, let's try focusing on the game for once. I've noticed a couple of mistakes with you getting these coins so far. Running into walls and getting zapped by an amp. Are you turning into Joe? Great bait, mate. Well, like I said, it's been a while since I've done these, so I am bound to make some mistakes. It just doesn't seem as clean as your usual gameplay. I, I don't know how else to explain myself. Look, I'm not trying to be a dick, I'm just saying, dude. Our viewers are watching, dude. You make a valid point, no doubt. Well, that seemed pretty clean. Thank you, Joe. Yeah, that was pretty good. And we can just exit here. No need to fight this Bowser again, so it's your turn, Joe. All right, awesome. I'm ready to go. Ready to go to eternal sleep, maybe. Well, I'll see your fat ass there soon enough, I'm anyway, sure. Anyway, where would you like to go? Uh, um, let's, let's see. I think I'd like to go back to that map with the ship. Pretty cool vibes there, if I'm being honest. Jolly Roger Lagoon it is, then. That's banjo Tui Don. This map is Jolly Roger Bay. It could be Jolly Roger's cock and ball torture, for all I care. I got two of the words right, so who gives a damn? You are the epitome of mediocre is enough. Do you know that? Didn't ask. Anyway, Joe, head to the cave to get the next star on this map. All right, Barry, I'm going to shoot out of the cannon to get there faster. 
Lazy exploit. Well, you'd know all about that, wouldn't you, dipshit? Nah. You literally door dash McDonald's even though it's less than a mile away. I can afford to, so why waste my time? Maybe the mild exercise would do something about that beer gut. I like my beer gut. It gives me plenty of room to stuff more Big Macs in. Joe, what are you doing? You can't get into the ship. But this window is wide open. No, no, Joe. It's just how the model looks. You can't actually enter it. Yeah, so would you stop trying, you sleepwalking zombie freak? Oh, whatever. All right, now, just be careful here. Oh, how hard can it be? This is only like the third map, right? Just watch out for the falling stalagmites. I technically, Don, those would be stalactites, since they're shaped as if they come down from the ceiling. Who cares? An easy way to remember that is that stalagmite has a G in it like ground, and stalactite has a C in it like ceiling. What kind of lame nerd would I have to be to actually know that shit? Someone didn't play RuneScape growing up, and it shows. You sound like the type of kids I used to shove into lockers in school. Uh-huh, I'm sure you were one of the cool kids. Oh, God, not these fucking chests again, dude. It's the one to the right Shut of the... Shut the fuck up, Donald. I'm not falling for that again. <laughs> nice job, Joe. You got this. All right, yeah, come on, Joe. Hurry up so it'll be my turn. Slob on my knob, buddy. All right, now, which one? 50-50 shot. Uh, fuck. I'm just gonna go with my gut. And not my beer gut, if you know what I mean. I think he's got it. First try, too. How about that, fellas? Well, there's always a first for everything, as they say. Except nobody asked. Especially me. Dude, what does that even mean? Just shut up and grab the star. Hey, nice all right, job, Joe. Way to go. Star grab, Joe. Oh, yeah. Thanks, boys. All right, give me that controller so I can finish off this map like the pro I am. So what's left? The 100 coin star and red coin star? That's right, Joe. They are two separate stars, but since 100 coin stars don't boot you out of the level upon collecting them, it makes the most sense to grab it while you're getting the eight red coins, in most cases anyway. And so we have to sit through yet another one of Don's miserable, talentless, incoherent 100 coin star routes? I've given up on trying to teach him the official routes, so we just gotta support his freedom to play the game how he sees fit. You guys should have pen and paper out taking notes. I am improvising these routes as I go, and they're probably all world record worthy. You've got to be the most delusional man on the planet, rivaling Kanye West, even. Hey, now, he's a good guy. I've had many excellent talks with him, though I'm not the biggest fan of his music. Well, no shock there. His music is fucking garbage. Even I can rap better than him. For sure, dude's full of himself. Though beautiful, dark, twisted fantasy was pretty nice. He hasn't done anything on that level since then. Well, speaking of fantasy, I've been rereading the Harry Potter series and I plan to rewatch the movies after. And so I wanted to ask you guys your favorite book and favorite movie of the series? Goblet of Fire. Book or movie? Oh, Barry, you know the answer to that question. Movie, of course. Don can't read. Shut the fuck up, Joe. It's my favorite for both. I liked all the extra details the book offered, but in general, the whole concept of a high-stakes three-game tournament made for an exciting premise early on in the plot, where some of her earlier books seemed to drag on. Interesting take, Don. What about you, Joe? Oh, that's easy. Half-Blood Prince is the best book, bar none. I found the relationship drama exciting. The dark secrets surrounding Slughorn's memories of Tom Riddle loomed over us the entire way. And who can forget the Liquid Luck sequence? In the movie, I was laughing my ass off at how they portrayed that part. Super well done. Oh, yeah, that was Though the good. movie can't top that book for me. The best movie was Order of the Phoenix, simply for that deadly magic battle at the Ministry of Magic. Oh, man, what a thrilling cinematic masterpiece. What about you, Barry? For me, the best movie was Prisoner of Azkaban. Alfonso Cuaron doesn't get enough credit for the amazing lighting, direction, and camera work on that film. Truly the standout of the series. It was darker and more mature than the first two films. The plot was more cohesive, and it had Gary fucking Oldman. God, I love that said. guy. The best book, however, was obviously The Sorcerer's Stone. Barry, you're such a Gen Wonder. Shut up, Don. It all started in this book. J.K. Rowling's world building is simply astonishing. It's a shame she's such a transphobe and a racist now, or maybe she always was. Uh, I don't really care about that stuff. I try to separate the art from the artist. How did I know that would be your response to that? Probably because he's not willing to admit Cho Chang is a racist fucking name. She might as well have just called her Ching Chong. You guys must find it hard to appreciate anything if you have to nitpick the whims of every single artist out there. That's a really clever way of saying I don't care if an artist actively pays and voices support for a political party who is keen on stripping the human rights of its people as long as I get to enjoy their art. Shut the fuck up, Joe. All right, fellas, let's get back to the game. It looks like Don has almost finished this up and see we pass the time by finding something fun to talk about. I always do like debating opinions on shit. On shit, huh? 
Do you prefer dog shit or human shit? Why don't you eat shit, Don? Oh, for God's sake, enough, guys. You're like a couple of recalcitrant children. My bad, Barry. Hey, Good nice shit, job, Don. Don. That's right, another star go. for us. Yes, sir. Donald the Don at your service. Barry, you're up now. All right, to wrap things up for today, I'm going to get the 100 coin star on Cool Cool Mountain. It shouldn't take long since you can get most of them on the slide. So do you have a route for this one? Kinda. I've done a handful of 70 star runs before, so I get the general idea, I think. So what's the general strategy? Basically, just go down the mountain and collect enough coins before warping back to the top and getting all the rest on the slide, which is generally quite fast. I mean, to be fair, relative to Joe, everything in this game is fast. The only thing that will be fast is the guy pumping you full of spunk in prison. Jesus, Not Joe, faster than disgusting. my fist flying into your face, Joe. The only thing that will be flying into anyone's face is a Big Mac flying into yours and my dick flying into Melania's. He's dead. I swear to God, this time he's dead, Barry. I'm going to kill him. Is this the part where I gaslight you? Oh, I'm sorry, Don. Don't take it so seriously. I, it was just a prank, bro. I, Joe, you've been going a little hard on the Melania comments. Maybe time to let that one go? Yeah, maybe so. I'll think about it. Some thinking would probably overclock your brain, Joe. Some shutting the fuck up would probably be music to my ears. I swear to God, if you don't shut that ancient trap of yours, I'm going to clean the toilet with your toothbrush and bare ass your pillow. Literally lick my balls slowly and gracefully, Don. It's probably healthier for you than McDonald's, and I keep them smooth and shaved for hot encounters. Joe? Especially with your wife. Jesus, Joe. You know, sometimes you go too far, right? What are you talking about, Barry? You pissed him off. He left the room. Oh, that. Yeah, that. Barry, I don't know how to explain this to you, but you do realize that me and Don are always faking all of this, right? What the hell do you mean? I mean, we're not ever actually upset with each other. We just create a hostile environment to farm views for the channel because everybody loves conflict. I... Wait, really? Really. I don't know, Joe. He seemed genuinely upset. Well, yeah, he's a former television actor. He knows what he's doing. Watch, he'll be back in here any minute now to watch you get the star. See? I don't fucking believe it. I think you just made all that shit up. Believe what you want, Barry, but I love our leaving the room skits because it always gives me a good excuse to step out and get another Mountain Dew. I hope you got me one. Wait, how the hell are you going back up the slippery slide? Trick of the trade, Don. Also, you know we could just put a mini fridge in this room? You guys don't have to invent a reason to leave the room? I mean, just look at the exponential increase in channel views and revenue, Barry. I think our incessant shit talking is directly correlated. Correlation does not equal causation. Whatever, Barry, you're such a nerd. Anyway, let's hit it. We're going to Dairy Queen before they close, remember? Wait, what? Of course he fucking forgot. Oh, can it, you skin sack <laughs> of actual lard. Welcome back to the series and to the episode 10 special. To celebrate the 10th episode, we're doing a giveaway. In one of these 10 episodes, there is an obscure quote from Adam Sandler's Happy Gilmore. Whoever posts a comment telling us which episode it was, what the quote was, and a timestamp indicating where it is in the video will win a free trick of the trade beanie. It is pretty obscure, so you'd better know the movie well. And the only hint you get is that there are no hints. So eat shit. The answer will be revealed in episode 11, so submissions will be accepted until then. There will be only one winner, the first person to get it right. Good luck, everyone. Now let's get on with the episode. Hooray, it's my turn. You're the only one celebrating, believe me. Joe, hit the start button, and you can see which levels still have stars we've missed. OK, looks like Bob on Battlefield still has one. If I remember correctly, it's the red coin star plus 100 coins. So go ahead and do those together. I don't think I've done one of these types of stars before. I don't know any kind of route. It's fine, Joe. You can improvise. Just enjoy exploring the level. Oh, my god. I know I usually complain about Joe's turn. Don't, don't start, But this please. will actually take forever. I better get hospice care on the phone. Cap, you're actually just going to order food on the phone, Don. Don't lie. Barry, seriously, can't we just go drive through somewhere while he gets these stars? No, Don, we just got back from Dairy Queen. You don't need any more food. Haha, <laughs> yeah, fat ass. No more food for you, you fucking bridge troll. Joe, you better shut your trap before I murder your entire fucking family. Ah, more lies, Don. You couldn't even keep yourself from lying during our debate. I bet your asshole got jealous of all the shit that came out of your mouth. Dude, you couldn't even stay awake, bro. You hobbled over to the podium like a swaggering zombie freak. Don, the only the expectations people had of you for the debate was Nothing for you to not you be an asshole, and you couldn't even do that. Just another corporate All Democrat you do is embellish your speech with cringe and like emphasis about how you have the, the best everything and, and how everyone's talking about it. Literally nothing you said was even remotely credible. You want to talk about talking out of your ass? You're the poster child of bullshit. Superhero, you probably had to have your dad man. pay off your also, teachers just to let you pass high school. Yours, so there's that. Are we done, boys? You get that all out? 
Sorry, Barry, he just gets under my skin sometimes. I hate it when people comment on how I walk. Well, what the fuck do you expect? You shouldn't even be in office, dude. You're pushing 90. Yeah, pushing 90 fluid ounces of man milk into Melania's fur burger. For fuck's sake, Joe. For real, though, Barry, who do you think won our debate? It was no contest, right? It wasn't you, Only dude. one of Get us was it. even conscious for the whole thing. I definitely earned some points when I talked about inflation. Eat shit, Don. I earned the points when I discussed Medicare and abortion. You lost points when you couldn't form a complete sentence and drawled like a drunken sailor. You guys really want to know my thoughts about this? Yeah, yeah tell Barry, us who us won. Who got the most on, points? Man. All right. You guys asked for it. After watching that shit show, here's what I wanted to say to you guys. Mr. Biden and Mr. Trump, what you've just said, are some of the most insanely idiotic things I have ever heard. At no point in your rambling, incoherent responses were you even close to anything that could be considered a rational thought. Everyone in this room is now dumber for having listened to you. I award you no points, and may God have mercy on your soul. Okay, a simple wrong would have done just fine. Yeah, Jesus Christ, dude, calm down. Hey, don't ask questions you don't want the answer to. Nice job, Joe. Now to get the 100 coins. Come on, get up in the air already. Let's go. This map does have an absurd amount of coins only accessible by wing cap. Should be a piece of cake. Quick, mash the Z button, Joe. Like this? Exactly like that. Oh, hey, that. that was pretty cool. Only because Barry held your hand? I'll hold your son hostage if you don't shut the fuck up. I'd rather you held a funeral for yourself. No one would go. Project more. Eat my ass. That's fucking enough. For once in your lives, I'd like you to focus on the game. Of my course, bad, of Barry. Course. Nicely done, Joe. All right, Excellent Joe. Way to go, grab. buddy. Oh, uh, thanks, guys. I feel pretty good about it. All right, Don, you're up. Where are you off to? Oh. Um... Looks like Big Boo's haunt is next. Clean it up, Don. And don't take forever. Like you in the bathroom? Like you in the drive through bitch. Oh, fuck off. You can't even wipe your own ass anymore. Oh, yeah, I can't. Can you help me? Guys, please. Please just euthanize me when I can't even take care of my own wiping anymore. Don, there is no shot you can reach anywhere around the massive circumference of your rotund body to even so much as graze your ass cheeks. Shut the fuck up, Joe. Now, children, come on, let's focus. I want to see Don's 100 coin route for this map. Do you actually, though? Yes, I do. Remember what I said about supporting each other? Still sounds gay. Jesus, enough with using gay as an insult, dude. How old are you? Not as old as you, sleepyhead. Jesus, I'm getting bored already. Should I turn that Jeopardy music on? Joe! It's fine. He can talk all the trash he wants. I'm still better. Yeah, better at showboating all your mediocrity. Joe, you were literally a rectal birth. That's disgusting, dude. All Don talks about is buttholes. He's obsessed with buttholes. You know he only watches anal porn. That's strangely unvanilla of you, Don. Do not kink shame. You literally watch Zombieland on repeat because seeing women of your kind turns you on. Don, no! And I caught you beating off to The Last of Us clicker porn just the other day, in fact. Don, you swore you would never tell. Yeah, well, too late. Pick your battles next time, you fucking reanimated corpse. Oh! The hell was that? That's the sound he makes when he's feeling humiliated. Y'all are something else. All right, that's the 100 coin star. These really do take forever. And that's not shade I'm throwing, just commentary on the game itself. Hey, I guess you're right. All right, fellas, smash or pass? Stormy Daniels? Uh. Isn't that a little too soon, like for you, dude? I'd smash in a heartbeat. Thought you already did. Fuck off. Answer the question. Uh, pass, personally. Yeah, man, I'm good on that. I don't care for STDs much. You guys are so vanilla. All right, how about Greta Thunberg? Dude, isn't she, like, 14? Should be right up your alley then, Joe. Oh, fuck off. I'm Googling it. She's the climate activist from Sweden, correct? I'm cringing at that terminology, but yes, that's who we're discussing. Google says she's 21 now. My god, time sure fucking flies. Yep, Mr. Reaper will be coming for Joe any moment now. Hey, pass or smash, Melania Trump. Joe, I swear to god. God damn, I'd bury my face in those cheeks. That's it, I think I need a break. Can we please drive through somewhere? Uh, that's fine with me if you really need to. Joe? I think I'm gonna hang back, I don't need anything. Cool if I drive your car then, Don? Fine by me, let's go. What the hell do you think Joe's doing right now, anyway? Probably playing Stardew Valley or something. Dude, how do I get up here? What the fuck? I just watched that guy do it. This is bullshit. I... Uh, oh. Oh, fuck. Hey, an op. 
I'm an American goddamn sniper. Yeah, watch me go, boys. Yeah, that's right, bitch. Easy. Easy. Uh-huh. Daddy Joe Biden carries the team once again. Eat my balls, bitch. Can we please just drive through McDonald's, Barry? No, no, a million times no. I'm an American goddamn... Let me finish what I'm saying, bitch. Yeah, anyone else want a piece of this? Huh? How about you? Oh, you motherfucker. Yeah, take that. And you... Oh, fart. Kanye East with a... Uh, there's a scout. Don't worry, I got it. Easy, motherfucker. Yeah, you too, bitch. Easy. Let's see what's on the radio. Oh, wait a minute, Barry. I... Dude, what the fuck is this? I swear to God, I have no idea. Hey, oh, don't touch God, my son. friend. I got you, buddy. Just hold on. There we go. Fuck to you. Hey. Oh, my God damn it. I'm an American goddamn sniper. Oh, you bastard. Never bring an op to a scout fight. You sneak past him here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I got your number, motherfucker. Free op for Daddy Joe. And a free ball sack for you, buddy. Enjoy. Is this like what you listen to or something? Uh, no. Why would you think that? I like building milk on the floor. It is good for me and it's good for the floor. I'm just gonna hit next then. Very, I, uh... Fucking seriously, there's a part two? Wait a minute, this isn't the radio, this is a CD. Very, I can explain. This gibberish nonsense actually means something to you, doesn't it? Shut up, dude. Finally, I can afford an auto. I'm an American goddamn sniper. Let's see what I can pull off with this. What? Wait, what the fuck? Why don't teammate pop me? I shot. Are you fucking kidding me? Why would you do something like that? I do what I want, bitch. That's it, I'm getting this guy back. Can't wait to have a free gun. Yeah, see how you like it, huh? Yeah. Wait, what? I do it one time and I get banned? He just shot me in the head. Fuck this game, dude. I'm uninstalling this stupid goddamn fucking game. We're back, Joe. What you been up to? Nothing, nothing at all. Uh, what did you guys get to eat? We got Arby's. And I found out that Don listens Barry, to please, uh, I beg. some weird ass shit. Oh, did you bring me any? Thought you weren't hungry, sleepyhead. But yeah, we got you a few beef and cheddars and some curly fries. Oh my God, blowjob for you, sir. So what star are you getting, Barry? I'm grabbing the red coins of the second Bowser stage. Solid. I, uh, wait. We have the key from this stage, but I don't remember ever going here. You want to tell him or should I? I don't see the point, honestly. The point of what? What's there to tell? N nothing, Joe. Oh, okay. So you're just getting the red coins. Are you following a route or something? Kind of. I get the general gist of it, but I've never really grinded it out myself, so I'm just improvising it a bit. Looks pretty solid to me, dude. Yeah, honestly, it looks as though you have done this a few times before. Well, thanks, guys, but I'm really just trying to get us to a new stage. All right, best Smash Bros game, go. Brawl. I said best, not worst. Shut the hell up, Donald. Brawl is king. Just because it's the only one in the series that runs slow enough for you to process. It's the most accessible game in the series with excellent mechanics. Oh, yeah, like tripping? Great mechanic. You guys are toxic. Which one do you think is the best, Barry? And I swear to God, if you say melee... Melee, obviously. I said best, not most overrated. Just because you suck at wave dashing doesn't mean it's overrated. What other game can you make a goddamn black hole in? No one needs to make a black hole. What we need is a nice balanced game with a vast roster and no bullshit exploits. Watch, he's gonna say ultimate is the best. It's even in the title. It's the ultimate game, baby. God, you are so predictable. Just spitting straight facts, bro. Wow, Barry, you really made this map your bitch. Uh... 
I'd point out that you've made this map more your bitch than any human ever possibly could, but you wouldn't know what I'm talking about. No idea what you mean by that. Yeah, I know. Anyway, it's your turn, Joe. Where do you want to go? Well, that looks so fun, I want to go back to that other lava map. Do it up, buddy. Oh, hey, I almost forgot. Grab that bunny, Joe. He gives you a second star after you have 50 stars total. Seriously, dude, can you just get him on your turn, Barack? It'll be fine. Don't be such a whiny bitch. Jesus Christ, bro. Take a walk, Don. Who knows, you might burn some calories. Ooh, another fat joke. How original. Oh, my God. This Joe, is follow him to forever. the end of the hallway, then just do a cartwheel flip and dive forward on the right side of the hallway. Uh, okay. He's gonna fuck it up. I'm gonna fuck you up. Wow, just like that. Works every time. Well, at least that's over. Yeah, over just like your weight. Over just like your life very soon. Over like this broadcast if you two don't shut the fuck up. Sorry, Sorry Barry. Barry. All right, grab the eight red coins on this map, Joe. Oh, hey, I think I can take a shortcut here. That's not a bad idea at all, Joe. If only you would take a shortcut to your grave. Oh, you mean like eating fast food? Stop the cap. My doctors gave me a clean bill of health. Okay, who's really capping? Your MAGA doctors don't count as real doctors, jackass. Careful here, Joe. Watch how the platforms move. Oh, how hard can it be? All right, here we go. Just gotta get, oh, fuck. What the hell? Just gotta, Jesus Christ, dude. It just moves under my feet. Just take your time, Joe. All right, just a couple more. I got this, don't worry. He's toast. Oh, God damn it. Rip. Uh, no, fuck. Give the controller to Barry. Give the controller to Barry. Shut the fuck up. That is the easiest star in the game, and you still managed to fuck it up. Here, I'll just knock it out real quick. And then I get to go, woohoo. No one asked. Watch, Joe, here's how it's done. Eat shit, Don. You should be taking notes as well, you fucking useless orangutan. Get at me when you can collect If you seriously think your mid-ass gameplay is something to other people want to see, like goddamn fucking delicious. Shut the fuck up, guys. Nice hey, job, right, Barry. Go, well Barry. done, Let's dude. Go. Thank you, fellas. Don, you're up. Watch out, y'all. Donald the Don coming through, barreling in with another tough star, using insane mechanics only I could master. I'll take things that definitely aren't happening for 1,000, Alex. God rest his soul. Anyway, it looks like Don is going for the rolling log star. I don't need any help here, Barry. This one's got my name written all over it. Weird, I don't see retard written anywhere. Joe, you cannot use the R word. This is your final warning. Oh, God damn it. Sorry, Barry. A real man like me uses cool strats like this. Check it out, boys. Ha! Huh. Wow, great strat, dude. Fuck off. Now check out this elite log rolling I'm about to do. Why don't you pan the camera so you can see where you're going? Shush, Barry, I'm goaded. Oh, wait, no. Dude, what the fuck? No. What? Hey, Don, give the controller to Barry. Shut the fuck up, Joe. I guess I gotta clean up after both of you, huh? Oh, whatever. Just get it over with. I hate this world. Now Barry's gonna one-up you hard. Yeah, right. It's not like there's any other way to do this, Star. I showed you the only skip there is already. You sure about that? What the fuck are you doing? You'll see. Dude, what? Holy crap, Barry. How the fuck did you get over the fence like that? Trick of the trade, Don. Oh, for fuck's sake. Anyway, how about a new map, fellas? Hell yeah, my favorite part. All right, where are we going? Time for wet, dry world. I'm gonna grab the shocking arrow lift star by taking a hidden warp when the water level is low. All right, let's see it, dude. Wait, how in the hell did you know the water level would be low? The water level is fucking random every time I enter this map, and then I have to go change it to what I want. Well, G Don, just jump into the painting according to how high you want the water level to be. I jumped in at the bottom so it would be on the lowest setting. Are you fucking kidding me? How long has that been a thing? Since the game came out, bro. Wow, that's a cool little hidden mechanic they put in there. I agree, Joe. And you're up. Show us how it's done. All right, let me grab this controller here. Wait, jump in the map at a different height. I want to see if it affects the water levels. All right, show Don how it works. Uh, okay, let me uh, get some distance here. I'm on the edge of my seat. It's gonna work, watch. It'll be like medium water level height now. I don't believe it, dude. I think you just made that shit up. What other explanation could there be? I think China is just manipulating the water levels, how they see fit. They steal all of our water, and then they gaslight us by giving it back sometimes. You are one special guy, you know that? Didn't ask. China made this game after all. Actually, it was Japan. You know, home of the gaming giant, Nintendo. You say potato, I say potato. 
Anyway, Joe, you got that box out of the way. You can get the elevator star now. Oh, uh, okay. How do I do that? All right, jump on the left side. That'll send it down. Then you gotta be quick and go inside the cage and get on top of the lift before it starts going up again. Oh God, this seems tough. This was always one of the tougher stars in the game, if I'm being honest. Pretty precise time challenge. Wow, nice wall jump, Joe. Damn, that was actually pretty clean. Uh -huh, thanks guys, I don't know where that came from. You probably dreamt about double chocolate chip momentarily. You're probably right, honestly. Nice star, go, get, Joe, nice awesome work. job. Much appreciated. You're up, Don. Which one are you going for? I want to do the race through downtown Star, one of my favorites. What if I told you you don't need the cannon to get over there? Well, sure, show me what you mean, but after that, no more help for this star. Just triple jump and dive up onto the wall on your left there, and you'll slide right into the caged area. Huh? How would that even work, dude? Just trust me. Okay, here goes. Damn. Yeah, that's pretty much it. I don't know where you get these insane ideas from. What the fuck are you doing? Just messing around. What are you doing still alive? Wondering why you're so shit at this game. Bite me, Joe. Now to perform the Vanish Cap Dash through downtown. Pay attention, fellas. Why is it that you like this star so much? Because it's cool. It takes a while to get to. It's well hidden, and you have to earn it by beating a speed challenge. Wait, what the fuck? Dude, what? Oh, oops, you're right, wrong way. No, what? How are you going through those walls? What do you mean? I'm using the vanish cap. Yeah, but those aren't passable walls, only the cages. Eh, trick of the trade, Barry. Shut the <laughs> fuck up, Donald. I can't believe I didn't know about that. What the hell? <laughs> anyway, nice job. I learned something new today. And I'll go ahead and do one more star before we wrap up. Sounds good. And hey, I'd just like to say thank you to everyone for sticking with us this far. It's been a real blast having you all here to support us and enjoy the content. We really hope you enjoyed the episode 10 special. Why are you giving a eulogy? Do you plan on dying shortly here on the set? Don, a eulogy is given for someone who has already died. And you typically don't give one for yourself since you're you know, already dead. Well, I'm changing that immediately. Joe, go ahead and write yourself a eulogy, my guy. You'll be the first person to ever write his own eulogy, and I'll read it at your funeral tomorrow. Lord knows no one else would waste their time giving you Shut one. the fuck up, Don. One more Big Mac and your arteries are gonna burst. Your buttery blood is gonna spurt all over this room and we're gonna be left putting snapped, the bill for cleaning. If one of your bones it would be like a domino effect. And we'll never get the smell the out, just imagine. Just collapses It'd be worse than a cat a urine accident. That shit floor, never comes me. out. We'd have to burn down the White House and because no one would I don't buy know what's it and it would be pathetic. the war of 18. And with all that said, thank you so much for joining us, everyone. Good luck on the giveaway contest, and we'll see you in episode 11. Cheers. As you honestly so can't be empathetic. eating that stuff anymore. Probably not good it's for just anything, a matter of time. Honestly. TikTok, Don, McDonald's will be the death of you, buddy.